great turnout today for the Village Economy Summit, the inaugural one here in Pittwater. Um, over 100 people, businesses, uh, practitioners, uh, chambers of Commerce, um, excellent turnout. Really yeah, well. it's been fantastic. We've got about at least uh, 10 different council areas here today who are interested in what we're doing in Pittwater, but also discussing the broader issues of good urban design. So that's how the Laneways program then evolved into the Fine Grain program. And that was to encourage new, unique, innovative, interesting businesses into the underutilised spaces, not just the laneways. So whilst Economic development. And new shops are also kind of locating themselves just off that laneway because they can see all that activity and so therefore they want to be where that activity is occurring. So this is why it's very important to think about where the connections are. Where are people arriving in the centre and also um, where are they going to? Some fantastic place making opportunities and examples. We've talked a lot today about places and I think it's always really important to think well what makes a place and that's something that we share depending on the size and the, and the location of the place that we're talking about. When yeah. it's, been, it's been really interesting. Yeah and look it's based too I mean we've got an award-winning economic development plan and social plan uh, so the basis of the, the, uh, the summit has been around those plans and now we're just taking it forward to look specifically at Mona Vale and, uh, and then beyond that. It's been a great opportunity to really showcase our, our enlivened pit water strategy which has been you know, really primarily bringing mm. the vibrancy back into um, Pittwater's town and village centres. So everyone seems to be really enjoying that concept and, and looking at what we've done and the projects that we've been able to achieve. So it's been an excellent opportunity for that. Yeah, and now look, we're sort of in the um, ideas generation mode. We, yeah. can, we can learn off other councils, they can learn what we're doing and what a great opportunity to swap ideas and just get this vibrancy in our, our village economies moving. Get that place plan happening for Mona Vale and Pittwater more broadly. That's right, that's right. I mean, we're lucky too. We've got a community day on tomorrow. We'll be engaging with the community really solidly tomorrow, um, finding out what they want, what their needs are now and into the future. Yeah, we're really looking forward to having broad discussions tomorrow about about Mona Vale and, and actually giving the community an experience that they haven't had yet in Mona Vale where we're closing off a lane, um, we're using some of the placemaking uh, examples that they've used to, that they've spoken about today and putting it into practice in Mona Vale. So I think we'll get a lot of community interest from that as we have today. Yeah. And look, that, that whole business backing has been really useful for this summit. We've had, we've got businesses here displaying today, we've got businesses involved uh, tomorrow and the whole process over the last 12 months with Enliven has been really engaging with business and their contribution has been just really superb. I think we're going to get a lot more interest from this summit, Paul. Yes, just the start isn't it? Yep, and just then the start. We'll be moving on looking at how we can enliven and, and get things going for Mona Vale and Pitwater. Pitwater, yeah. Yeah, exactly.